Uncle Joe's Spelling Show for... For, uh, for July the 21st and the 19th. Boy, it's been a long time. Some things never change. What's up, Uncle Joe? <laughs> it's been a long time. It's been like two months since we've done a show, and a lot has changed. It's been a long, long, it's lonely, July. lonely, lonely, lonely time. Lonely. Today, the word for today is enthusiasm. I'm enthusiastic. I, I'm filled with enthusiasm. Go ahead. That we're doing the show again. Me too. <sighs> E-N-T-H-U-S-I-A-M. Is the conventional spelling. And then enthusiasm, if you were to spell it simply, same way. Yeah, that's ridiculous. The S makes the Z sound. Enthusiasm. It's not enthusiasm. Uh, uh, English spelling. It's not a word with a lisp. The, the, the you have to say Z. Don't give me the better part of wisdom. This is phonetics. The best of English spelling uh, it has a bit of flexibility with the S, with the uh, Z, S. Toys. Toys. And there's no toys. reason to put a Z in the place of an S in the toys. But you want it to spell the way it sounds. So not, there's not, a great not, utterly, not utterly. Not utterly. Not utterly. the dumbing down of America, people. Ooh, don't go there, because I'll just bite your head off and feed it to the swims. I miss you, man. I want to give a shout-out to my Aunt Rita. <laughs> I do. I miss her. Aunt Rita, your nephew is officially a judge. we got to start the show off with that. Go ahead. Praise judge him. Judge Roy Bean, the hanging judge, has uh, visited himself into New York City in the guise of yours truly. I'm a judge. Can you believe this? America truly is going down. Well, well, say what kind of judge you no, are. No, no. I cannot discuss my <laughs> judge job. I will not discuss. I am an administrative law judge for the city of New York, and that's all we can say. Because that's a job now, and I ain't messing it up. The two words, kindergarten cop. So what have you been doing for the last three weeks? <laughs> you went to North Carolina I have, I have twice. Not I have not become a judge. Well. I want to know why we haven't done a show. Except for your little foray into judgeism. I haven't been here. Judaism. You're a Judy, Judaizer now? Is that what you are? Serious. Are you a Judaizer? Are you a judi mocking? A judicator? Are you a are judicator? Are you mocking the responsibility <laughs> of casting legal judgment upon another human I, being? I'm trying to have it clarified into simply, simpler... We language. can't talk about that. Simple language. We can't talk about that all to say that I will, Oh, you can't. Well, I can just go there then. I will not. Go you. But I will say this. <laughs> I will not per aid and abet. <laughs> abet. Funk. Abet. Abet? Uh, what did I say? Oh, we've put Ron into a judge position. What did I say? Oh, abet. Oh, I said abet. Oh, I'm oh, tired. It's oh, like, oh, I've been here since 6.50 this morning. I will not aid and abet. <laughs> New York City has put... Functional. into a position of authority. <laughs> I will not. I'm going to say this one more time. Oh, yeah. I will not. Aid, aid in a bed. Functional. Etatizing. Illiteracy. <laughs> Learn some new words, Pronunciation. People. Three syllables Pron are, are not your enemy. Pronunciation is the key word, right? I've said too much. <laughs> Yesterday. At the mission. I want to give a shout out to my friend Mick Cantarella. You always give a shout out to Mick. He needs a shout out every day that we do this show. Mick, Mick is a great guy, though. Mick, you are Mick is wonderful. Free services, volunteer. You know his services are worth a fortune. He he photographizes at the mission. That's enough. He cuts the video down to size. He cuts the audio. He adds visuals to the audio. He doesn't he want makes... you blabbing about him on YouTube. I had four hits yesterday, as I said earlier. Four oh, hits. Tell four us hitter. about our new fan. Who's our new fan? We got to give a shout out. His name is Chris. Chris, you're our hundred millionth Chris, subscriber. I want to give you a big shout out. Thank you. Chris. He actually contacted us. He's a he's a dad at at my school. Did you? I know him. <laughs> I know him. <laughs> I thought I didn't know him. Chris, I know you. That takes that takes that takes some of the charm off. I don't the, know the you. Bloom. The bloom is off the rose. I had four hits yesterday. You played softball. Slow pitch, old timers uh, softball, but they were Chris. Pop. Stop saying pop. You punch a ball into the outfield. You I don't pop, pop it. it. You pop it up. You punch it out to the outfield. I pop that ball, baby. You punched it. Learn your lingo. Big Poppy won the home run derby. LeBron James went to Miami. You know, here's my... This is all I'm going to say. The best about. team of all time, the Miami, <clears throat> Miami Heat. No. This is the only thing I'm going to say about LeBron James. This is America. 
If you want to change jobs, hey, I just kind of change jobs. If you want to change jobs, that's fine. My only beef is understand that you come from that state. Understand that that state has, that city in particular, has nothing to cheer about. They are depressed. They have no championships in 40 years. You were the hope and glory and the homecoming king. If you're going to leave, leave well. Leave well. Don't call a news conference and, on ESPN, primetime, Thursday night, 9 p.m., as primetime as television gets, and, to say, oh, I'm not coming back home. Instead Please. of instead of, instead, instead of, of having your agent just say, like every other agent does, oh, LeBron James, here's a statement, LeBron James will be joining the Heat, he's exercised his right to go somewhere else, and, he, you know, that's in, it. Instead of leaving well, he left well enough alone. This has been the Uncle Joe Spelling Show. I miss you, Uncle Joe. We're not done. I'll well, just that. I'll just fake him. Go back to Cleveland, LeBron. You know that's that's the truth. Uh, leaving is okay, and that, that's the, the you know the folks that say, "Well, he's not a slave." You know the well, uh, the, I'm the, not the a slave, the, and I stay here. The Jesse Jacksons of the world say, "Well, he's not a slave," and then the, uh, the, the Cavaliers owner is treating him like a slave. No, no, no. He left very poorly. He left poorly. That's so, that's my only beef. You want to go to Miami? Go. This is America. Go win fifty championships. But I'll tell you this: they're never going to compare you with Michael Jordan. Because as Jordan Apley said, he would have never called Bird and Magic and said, let's join a team. If you can't win on no, your own, Bird, Poppy. Bird, Bird said that? Jordan said that. Jordan you know, said that? You know Bird would say Bird, look at <laughs> I guarantee you that Magic, Bird, Jordan approve of this a combined 0%. Zero. You be the man. They were the man. I should have ended it a minute ago. This has been the Uncle Joe Spelling Show. Uh, more, uh, <laughs> more. What are we gonna do this again? <laughs> Goodbye. What, what are we gonna do this again? Again. No, no. Serious. Thursday. Thursday. Of come next back. Week. Come back Thursday.